back, you know, from the city to the shoreline and everywhere in between. There's a lot of beauty to be captured in Michigan. If you love snapping photos of the Mitten State, you'll want to listen up as a photo contest is coming that puts its focus on Pure Michigan. Joining us this morning, Marketing Director Courtney Sheffer from the West Michigan Tourist Association. Good morning, Courtney. Good morning. Thanks for having me. Absolutely. Thanks for being here. Can, tell us what, what types of photos can be entered into this contest? Yeah, we're looking for photos of West Michigan. Um, by that, we mean the entire west half of the Lower Peninsula, as well as the UP. So lots of different areas are covered with this. And we're actually looking for five different categories this year. Each category has its own prize. So we're awarding prizes for the best nature photo, downtown photo, beach and lake photo, people photos, and then we'll open them up for a public vote on social media as well. And they don't need to be pictures you took this year. So if you haven't been out traveling very much, that's fine. Go ahead and pull out some pictures from your last Lush Michigan adventure. Photos from all seasons are welcome. That was my next question. Yeah, does it have to be something that happened this year? So even if you've got a photo from years past that you thought was just the perfect photo that represented Michigan, uh, you can still enter that. Now, is, is there a deadline? Yes, you have until July 28th to enter your photos. It's really easy to enter. You can find all the rules on our website at WMT.org. You're able to send your photos in by email, so you don't need to download any apps or set up any new logins. We'll just need to know where you took the photo, and then you can tell us a little bit about what it is that you captured in your photo. Let's talk about uh, that, about how to get the photo to you. Uh, if people don't have digital means, can they mail it in? Can they do a copy? Uh, <laughs> explain that app and how that works. We do have it set up as a digital photo contest right now, so you just have to email them in. Um, a lot of times you can attach it right from your phone or from your computer and then send that right in through, through whatever email you have set up. That'll work. It'll get us over to us, and then you'll be all set. Perfect. And uh, you mentioned prizes. Okay, there's lots of different categories from taking that great shot of the architecture in downtown wherever you are, <laughs> or look at shots like this where you're seeing the reflection of the blue sky on Lake Michigan and beautiful sunsets and the waves crashing in. I mean, there are so many great areas to take pictures of the lighthouses. What about prizes? What can we win? Yeah, we've got some great prizes of lots of different overnights around the area. So we'll send you to Petoskey for the night. We'll send you to Evergreen Resort and Cadillac. You can go to Mount Pleasant for the night and lots of fun things to do. So it's all very experiential. It'll get you out and really get you to learn more about West Michigan. You can visit Binder Park Zoo and feed a giraffe for free. Go to the Oliver Art Center, visit Frederick Meyer Gardens. So lots of great West Michigan experiences in these prize packs. Sounds like the perfect prize for this contest to be able to get out and enjoy more of Michigan if your, cont if your photo is chosen. Now, you mentioned the fifth category there was a public vote. Will there be a certain website that we can go to to vote? Yes, so starting August 1st, we'll have the top 50 photos up on the West Michigan Facebook page for the voting. So you'll be able to hop on there and browse through Travel West Michigan digitally by looking through all these great photos. And you can vote for all of your favorites at that point. Cannot wait to take a look at what people find. You can, with the phones on the on the cameras on the phones these days, I mean, you can get some crystal clear HD photos right there on your phone and send it into this West Michigan photo contest. Thank you so much for the time, Courtney. Accepting entries right now, as you heard Courtney say, through July 28th. Public voting takes place via Facebook in early August. Now, to submit an entry, just visit that website right there on your screen, wmta.org. Of course, we'll have a link at fox17online.com.